I guess the biggest problem is that I haven't had, have not really had the, the desire to shape that much. It's always been like a, a therapy thing in that the planets had to be aligned for me to even go in the shape of that. I've probably been like that for a long time, you know, 10 or 15 years. But the enthusiasm that the boys have shown in writing my old boards, you know, what they've actually been doing on them, and the performance thing, that's got me pretty much fired up again um, to, to, to actually shape. They're directly responsible for that. I think it would be exciting for Terry knowing that we're so enthusiastic about surfing his boards. Like, I really appreciate the shapes and the way they surf. And for him as a craftsman and a designer, I know for sure he'd be super, super stoked about that. I'm so passionate about the boards that I'm on a high when I'm talking about them and I don't even shape them or create them. I'm assuring guys that they're the best boards I'll ever surf. I'm so passionate about them. I absolutely love them. It reminds me of a warm, safe place where as a child I'd hide. Pray for the thunder and the rain to quiet the pass me by. I Surfing needs to have variables in it. It needs to have variation. It needs to have more than just the ASP. You know, yeah, of course. Um, or I shouldn't say that, but more than the high performance side of the sport. Because that's what surfing is not more than just 10 points and $100,000. Mm. Know? For most people, it's it's a takeoff, two turns and a wipeout, and that's what they've got to get through the week.